Hello and welcome. Please pause the video, read the problem, and try it on your own. Let's start by reading this problem together. So that Fred is given a rectangular piece of paper. So as soon as I see that, I have a tendency to sketch it out. So I want to sketch my rectangular piece of paper. And I know they tell me that the length of Fred's piece of paper is represented by 2x minus 6. I'm going to label the length. I usually think of this as height or length. And then how wide I think of a person standing up, and this is how wide they are across. The width or how wide the shape is is represented by 3x minus 5. Then the paper has a total area represented by which of the following? Well, to find area, what do we do? We multiply length and width. So if this is the expression for our length and this is the expression for our width, we can just multiply them. So we have 2x minus 6 times 3x minus 5. So here to multiply this, I think of distributing 2x to both terms here and here. So 2x times 3x is 6x squared. 2x times negative 5 is negative 10x. Then I distribute the negative 6 to the terms, to the 3x and the negative 5. So negative 6 times 3x is negative 18x. And negative 6 times negative 5 is positive 30. And then here we can simplify or add terms. So I can combine these two terms right here, the negative 10x and the negative 18x. That gives me negative 28x. So altogether, I'm getting 6x squared minus 28x plus 30. That's choice two. All right, hope this helped.